about you? Where are you? Oh, there you are. Well, if you come over here, you'll find a wonderful surprise. You'll have to plug into the central computer. Oh, you where are you? That's right. Oh. Have you ever felt that you are just one out of billions of people on the planet? Well, you might be, but that doesn't mean you're not special to God. God made you, uniquely you, and he has a very cool plan for your life. The fact is, God made us so we can all have a relationship with him, the kind of relationship where you could actually talk with him about anything that's on your mind. Now, getting to know God is the goal, because when you know God, it makes it easier to live out his plan for your life. However, there is a challenge. Yeah, you probably knew that was coming. Here's the deal. God is perfect and lives in heaven, and we have become separated from him. Not because he's in heaven and we're on earth. We're separated because of sin. Sin is when you do wrong things or make bad choices. Choices that are different from what God would want you to do. God knew the only way to connect us back to himself was by sending his only son Jesus to save us. The Bible says, God demonstrates his own love for us in this. While we were still sinners, Christ died for us. Now, Jesus was born more than 2,000 years ago and lived a sinless life on earth. A life that was demonstrated by love, healing sick people, and sharing God's wisdom and truths with others. It's because of his sinless life that Jesus was able to fix our relationship with God. Jesus loved us so much that he died on a cross to take the punishment for our sin. And he came back to life three days later. This greatest act of love is what bridges the gap between you and God. Jesus is the way to eternal life with God. Accepting Jesus as your Savior will begin your relationship on earth as well. The Bible says, if you confess with your mouth, Jesus is Lord, believe in your heart that God raised him from the dead, you will be saved. To start this relationship with God, you need to open your heart and say that Jesus is your Lord. So, what do you think? It's not that complicated, is it? Our bad choices have separated from God. Jesus connects us back to God. We just need to turn away from our bad choices, our sin, and say that Jesus is our Savior. Would you like to get connected to God and ask Jesus to become your friend right now? To begin your relationship with God, just repeat this prayer. Dear God, I admit that I have done things that are against your will for me, and that I want to have a relationship with you. Please forgive me for my sins. I believe in my heart that Jesus died and rose again to take away my sin, and I declare Jesus Christ as my Lord and Savior. Please fill me with your Holy Spirit, that I may be faithful to do what you ask me to do. Thank you for saving me and letting me become your child. Please speak to me and help me to hear your voice and to follow the way you want me to live. I look forward to spending time with you both here on earth and in heaven. Thank you for saving me, and thank you for hearing my prayer. In Jesus' name, Amen. Hit like, subscribe, and the notification bell so you won't miss any of the next videos.